Hello Unity developers, today we're gonna make free items shop in Unity for, for your games. So this is just a ready tutorial with ready script. So what you need to go, first go to services, enable in-app purchasing and go to package manager and update it to version 441 because that version re requires Google billing number 4 and 5 that's the new policy from Google so that Google always something uh, changing some policy so uh, what now go and create in-app manager empty game object and just what we need to do is one script. I already uh, finished this script and it's it's already done. So uh, I will show you this script. So it's some um, free items. So this is our item ID, item ID one, item two, and bonus item three. So when player bought this, it will activate your uh, your item. So this is. Uh, very important so uh, this item we're gonna just copy and go to window services in a purchasing in app catalog and make bonus item one con non-consumable item two non-consumable and also bonus item three this is very important to make the same so non-capital letter no capital letters here so it must be three same items like here. So this is very important. After that, go and create also in your Google Play console, in your game, go and to in-app products and create a product and also name it the same from this script. So make three products and this is item one, so uh, every player who bought this will be activated. Item one, so, so player will activate item one. So this is for your game. It's uh, it's uh, also you can set price. So it's four euros, three to one dollar, any anything. So update applies prices so i will discard this because this is only test so bonus item one here bonus item one in script and bonus item one in unity in app catalog that is very important so what do you need to do it's so simple so three items drag and drop it drop it so this is item one two and three this is your game sword or some uh, game character or game level so this is your anything you want to activate it and to stay activated uh, activated after player bought this so it's non-consumable so consumable is when you buying coins or, or you can by it unlimited time so uh, if I uh, set consumable so uh, this is not good for this because we want to stay activated so we want only player to bought this item once and to stay activated in whole game so uh, go here and just drag and drop your three items so item one item two and item three so just drag and drop it to your unity in a purchase script uh, after that what we need to go do is go to make three buttons i already done it but that's the in-app purchasing, so right click on your canvas, in-app purchasing, in-app bu uh, button. So you see button and choose bonus item one. On another button, choose bonus item two and bonus item three. So this is going to delete. You see what will happen when player bo uh, click this, it will activate it. bonus item one two and three so 
free buttons and free items so that's all you need to have so in our in our script bonus item item one will be false and when player bought it it will be true so let's check test it T test it you see click it and buy it you see buy bonus item one buy bonus item two and buy bonus item three and it will stay activated so when the player bought it so it's ready to use it uh, all the time so uh, that's all you need to do uh, also in the script uh, you just need to set this to true this is for testing but for uh, in real phase after publishing you will just change this to true so I will also upload the script if you want so uh, so you can use script in any any your games so it's the script with uh, that's all that is ready so it using three items you can use one or two items with this script I already tested it so you see it will be it it will stay activated so that's all uh thank you for watching if you have any any questions so uh leave in comments uh, thank you thank you